have decided to extend the IUI camp for the month of June as well. Patients have been extremely happy and we have been able to give them good success rates due to which we have decided to increase the time for this IUI camp. Thank you. Hi, I'm Dr. Suvarchla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. A number of couples come to us and say that they are not able to achieve pregnancy because there is something wrong in the way they are having intercourse. And one of the most important factors or uh, problem that they bring in front of us is that the entire semen is left out when they are having intercourse. Remember, that is how nature designed it to be. The entire semen is supposed to be left out and only the sperms then swim up. Semen has a lot of things which are not good for the uterus. In fact, when semen is left inside the uterus, there can be contractions, there could be infections, there could be all kinds of problems in the uterus that could be leading to dangerous issues as well. So, nature designed it in such a way that the semen is left behind and only the motile sperms swim up. Uh, it's a very natural factor that the sperms swim up and semen is entirely left behind in the cervix. If you are uh, trying to get pregnant and you're worried that this is happening, do not be. But an important factor is that many women, when probed, when history is taken, they reveal that soon after they have intercourse, they take bath. They take bath with soap and they wash themselves and all. Remember, sperms die in the exposure to water or soaps or any deodorants, anything. So, be very sure that you do not wash yourself soon after intercourse. Of course, after some time, the sperms anyway swim up and uh, the sperms cannot be affected by bathing or soaps or whatever you use. So, these are very critical points to remember uh, while having intercourse and do not be worried if the semen is left out. Thank you. A lot of effort has gone into making this video. Please like and subscribe us. Thank you.